What's going on guys, this is Sherry of Lightning back with another Digimon video. We have all seen the poster for the next Digimon Adventure Tribe movie and in that poster we see a fan favourite Digimon returning and that of course is Wizardmon. And in this video I'm going to be explaining the reasons why it's correct for him to return and what his possible role will be in this movie. Bear this in mind guys, I have not seen any spoilers or anything so this is just me speculating from th the top of my mind. Firstly, we're not even sure if he's going to have a body or not. He could just come back just like the way he came back in Season 2 as a ghost Digimon, but I don't think he will. In the previous movie, we were left with what it seems like a world ready to implode in itself. We have the Dark Ocean resurfacing in the real world with the fusion of Riguelmon and Ophanimon fall down mode bringing about this world ending darkness and chaos. Everything is in chaos right now in the real world and even in the digital world as we saw in the previous movie that the mountains and landscapes are now disappearing which adds to the apocalyptic feel from the ending of the previous movie. But when Wizardmon returned last time, the world wasn't in chaos. If anything, last time Wizardmon was warning the Digidestin of a threat bigger than the Digimon Emperor which we learned later that it was Oikawa and Myotismon that Wizardmon was warning the Digidestin about. It won't make sense for him to return solely for the purpose of him giving an ap apocalyptic prophecy this time because we are experiencing that moment right now in the movie. So I don't believe he will come back as a ghost but I do believe he will regain his body somehow. And that could be answered with the digital reboot that happened a few mo movies ago. With the Dark Ocean now resurfacing in the real world and the digital world acting all strange, it could be that all three worlds are slowly merging together. As I mentioned earlier, the digital reboot could be one of the ways that Wizardmon could return. We saw two of the Dark Masters return in the previous film and yes, I understand they returned to the digital world and not in the real world, but now all three worlds are merged together. Who's to say that the effects of the digital reboot won't cross over into the real world and all the Digimon that died in the real world will be brought back to life just like the ones in the digital world. That could be one of the ways Wizardmon returns, but I think he might return in a different way. As we saw in the last film, we saw Marky and Tapermon go into the realm of the Dark Ocean. In the Digimon card game, we also see that Tapermon and Wizardmon are in the same dark family. I personally don't play the card game myself, but I learned that in the game and probably in the Digimon games as well, Tapermon can digivolve into Wizardmon. So with that being established, what I think is going to happen is, as we know, the ghost of Wizardmon is still lurking around in the real world and the Dark Ocean has now surfaced in the real world as well. So I think Wizardmon's ghost is going to take over Tapermon's body and digivolve Tapermon into Wizardmon because we know Wizardmon is a good guy and if he sees Kari and Gatumon in danger, he will give his life in order to protect them like a father figure or an older brother figure like Tai. He will see what's happening to them and he will notice Tapermon and take over his body to digivolve himself into Wizardmon and he will join the battle. That's what I think is going to happen in the movie. I hope it does. As fans, we have been speculating whether or not Wizardmon in the poster will be the Wizardmon of old, but if my theory is true, then it will be the Wizardmon of old. However, I don't see a happy ending for Wizardmon. I believe he would be brought back just to die again. But even with that, I believe he is going to be one of the ones to make the sacrifice in order to get Gatumon back into her senses. As we have seen in the latest few trailers, we do see the appearance of Magnadramon. So yeah guys, Wizardmon will die again, just like Neomon. So it should be an exciting end to the film. What do you guys think? Do you guys think my theory is a bit out there? Do you think that Wizardmon would die again? Do you think he'll just make a cameo appearance? Or you know, do you think I'm just talking, talking <laughs> utter rubbish? Just let me know in the comments down below. I will be trying to pump out more videos. Me and Dimsy are going to try and pump out more theory videos. We've got a few more videos lined up for you guys. So just, you know, <laughs> stay with us. And yeah, care for nothing. 